y'all see Mr. Childers? That's what we do when we boondock. We clean up. So whoever gets the spot when we leave, they don't have to worry about trash being everywhere. Ain't he a good man? He's a good man. I found treasure, everybody. Look at that. Look what all the people left behind for me to do. Lots of trash. Most of it's, 90% um, of it's tin cans. Some plastic bottles. A little few pieces of paper. But hey, one man's trash, another man's treasure. I got me some <laughs> treasure. And I'll take it into town. And put it in somebody's dumpster. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to help them out. Oh. Like pay it forward. We'd like to take care of our public lands, everybody. At least I do. I think... Just think if you know, only 1% of Americans did this, how clean our country would be. Seriously. Along, I mean, out in our parks and stuff, you know, cigarette butts. Oh, there's one right there. You know, I don't believe in throwing cigarette butts down. Now, I think it's people's right to smoke, and uh, but I don't think it's right to throw them on the ground stuff. Exactly. Get up. But anyway, uh, we're getting her done. Having a good time out here in the sunshine. That's right. Everybody else is freezing. But look at here. We got the <laughs> shorts on. <laughs> <laughs> a good old time. <laughs> Get the little generator going. Oh, Get yeah. TV later. Yeah. We're good to go. Just so everybody knows, out here in No Man's Land, we got 33 digital channels and two analog. And uh, that's pretty awesome. Look at that. Look at that. Clear as can be, too. Free TV, folks. Hey. Woohoo! Free camping, free TV. Got a generator on. We are loving life, and we're not cold. And it's 72 degrees. Yep. Perfect. No <laughs> snow. I'm sorry. No wind. I'm sorry, y'all. No, nothing. <laughs> we're just fat and sassy, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> While boondocking, if you have full solar, a lot of solar, to run a TV or a generator, you can watch TV. Now it's customary to run your generators two hours in the morning, two hours at noon, and then two hours before you go to bed. That way you can charge everything up. If you Like my husband, this is what he does. He likes to watch um, the news about stocks and the stock market and all that kind of stuff in the mornings. So, two hours in the morning, that's what he does. We usually don't watch TV in the middle of the day. I, we just don't. Um, but at night, you know, one of us will pick a favorite show and we'll watch it. But the other thing we do is we mirror from our phone onto our TV so we can watch our YouTube friends. Um, being out here when you're not fully hooked up, we like it. It saves us a lot of money and I mean, yeah, you can't watch TV 24-7, but I don't think that's why you're in an RV. I mean, we're not. <laughs> but you know, some people, they have to have their TV. So, either have you a Honda generator that's really quiet and nobody can hear it. And you can watch TV all you want. Um, this morning, we have the generators running. I made smoothies for breakfast this morning. I went ahead and cleaned up the house. We make sure that um, the, the phones and cameras and all that kind of stuff are charged up. These pop lights here have rechargeable batteries in them so we make sure those are charged. Um, I wash dishes like this because we fill these jugs up, these tea jugs here, we fill them up with water before we come out. And to save water, this is how I wash my dishes. This, this one is the dirty water. I have a couple more things to wash in here. But this is the rinse water. So what I'll do to save water, because we are in Arizona where it is precious, uh, this becomes my wash water for the night. I'll fill up the tea kettle and boil some water in there. Fill up my tub with hot water 
and then I'll fill this one up with some some hot water and some out of the jug and I just keep switching them back and forth like that to save on the water out here is to wipe everything out with paper towels and that way you're not using a lot of water and your water's not getting disgusting so but that's blue in the sink because I used my ninja and the blades had the blueberry all over them and you know I mean boondocking is very it's very easy I just don't know why people think it's not I mean, we charge up, we charge up the computer so he can get on there and do his financial stuff. I can do my videos. I mean, you know, I mean, you're charging and, and we have a residential refrigerator. So, uh, we, it keeps everything cold in there and we don't have to worry. I mean, six hours a day is enough for your refrigerator to run. Well, this refrigerator anyway so you know I mean and the, this refrigerator doesn't draw very much on the uh, generator um, things like the microwave yeah the microwave draws big time on our generator but I mean you just have to decide what you want and to warm things up, I mean, it only got down to 49 last night, but it was kind of chilly in here this morning. So we just turn a burner on and it warms it up real quick in here. And if it was cold and I was running in the generator, we could have the fireplace on and, you know, knock the chill off. So there's many options. We also have a buddy heater just like everybody else. <laughs> but, hey. It's it's all good. Gets down to it, and you cannot afford uh, so much propane and whatnot. Put more clothes on. That's what we do, <laughs> just to save. So, you know, I mean, being in an RV and boondocking is not that bad, folks. I mean, we have all we have everything that we have when we're um when we're full hookup you know, it's all good it's all good as you can see we have plenty of light in here it's just these leds that are running right now not the lamp and there's plenty of light in here plenty we even have reading lights above the bed there and I have candles up here, and I light those, and it makes it so romantic in here. There, even with the candles lit, it's, it's nice and cozy in here. I love it. See, you can see we have our LEDs on that are run off the battery on inside. Look here. There's the super moon right above us. We got a solar light right here. So if we're out here walking around. Okay. There it is. Hey, plenty of light. Plenty. Here we are. I love it.